Well, I'm seeing a little trend here, just watching myself um, do this every week is uh, a couple months ago, we were at, when I started this, we were at 47,000 homes for sale or properties for sale in the MLS area, okay? The MLS area isn't just one county, it's this huge geographic area, part of big chunk of Florida. Um, 47. 47,000 properties for okay. sale, okay? Then I remember we checked back a couple of weeks later, it was 48,000, right? Blah, blah, blah. And then another week it was 48,000 again. And then I saw 49, we're at 50,361. Now I'm not saying that's high or low because I don't have a baseline to work off of. But what we are seeing is when I started doing this uh, three or four months ago, we've seen 47,000. So inventory increase. About 5% right. increase in inventory. Yeah. It's great for buyers. Right? Yep. I'm telling mm -hmm. you, it's a great time for buyers right now. The interest rates are lower. You know, we screw the Fed rate cut. Get that out of your mind. We're at the lowest rates for two years, the 6.0. Yeah, for anybody thinking they didn't get a benefit from the Fed rate, no, we got the benefit. It just happened over the last two months yep. instead of just on from Wednesday to Thursday. Right. We've, yeah, we, we've gotten the benefit. And if you've been yeah. listening to this show, we've been telling you how healthy the interest rates have been dropping over time. And when they were high, we told you that too. Right. We're not sitting here trying to sell you something. We're trying to tell you what's going on so you can make the proper decision for you and your family.